How are you doing? I'm Peter Pumai, the director of Christian Tech Point College. And today I am with three of our electrical instructors. And to my left uh, is Mr. Vito uh, Gentile, uh, construction uh, instructor. Uh, to my right, Mr. Steve Pellarella. And to my far right is Mr. Ted Pulaski. Uh, all electrical instructors all do different things in the school for the student body. And what I'd like to do is just turn the mic, so to speak, over to these guys and tell you a little bit about the electrical career and what Point College can do for you if you're interested in an electrical career. Uh, I don't know who else to start. Mr. Gentile, why don't you, uh, you know, start it off and just say what you think is, uh, is good to say. Okay, here at, here at Point, we're going to teach you not only the basic fundamentals of getting out there and being an apprentice, but also the why. And anybody can teach you what to do, but we're going to teach you why you're going to be doing this, why we do certain things that we do that will actually give you a leg up and anybody else that it just comes straight in as an apprentice. So you're going to get a little more background, you're going to get a little more uh, knowledge of the why, as, as, uh, along with hands-on and doing it. Excellent. Excellent. One of the things that I really uh, think that we have here at COIN that uh, makes us and has us stand out from perhaps some of our competition is someone like Mr. Gentile who's able to tell you why as well as how. Because Mr. Gentile has been in the field over 30 years. Myself and Mr. Kulowski have also been in the field two decades plus. We have the experience, we've been out there, we know what we need to do, and we really kind of cut to the chase. As opposed to giving you a bunch of useless work that really doesn't get you anywhere, the things that you're going to do here are real world things. You're going to learn how to think. You're going to learn how to work out there. You're going to learn how to open up that code book and find the answer that you need so that you can execute a job without having somebody hold your hand, without having somebody show you the way that you have to do each of the things that you do. Ultimately, down the line, you might find yourself supervising projects. You might find yourself in charge. That's what we would hope to see as you move down your career. Well, my name is Ted Blouski, and it's a pleasure to be with Mr. Gentile and Mr. Pellarelli, the very good instructors. And um, I can say uh, firsthand that uh, if you do come to Coin College, you are definitely going to learn from Mr. Gentile how to wire a residential uh, location, learn how to bend conduit, that's the pipe that the wires, the conductors run through, uh, how to set up uh, light switches, light fixtures, receptacles, um, how to troubleshoot uh, house wiring. Gen Mr. Gentile is an expert at that. He's been doing that 30 years. He has his own business. Extremely competent. Mr. Pillarelli uh, is uh, Mr. Pillarella is uh, a supervisory electrician. Uh, very few of those in the city of Chicago, about 2,000. He's an expert at the NC code book, the Chicago code book. You will definitely learn how the codes are uh, interpreted in the book and how to do things legally and not uh, just wire something up that you know, somebody just might know how to wire a receptacle. He's going to give you the legal method on how to wire a house up in the city of Chicago. So you're going to have two experts that are going to teach you everything you need to know. Mr. Pillarelli uh, uh, additionally is going to be teaching um, not only the code class but the um, Commercial construction, if you decide to take our associate's degree, um, the commercial construction, uh, which you'll see back here, is uh, how to wire uh, facilities like restaurants, nightclubs, uh, stores, convenience stores. So uh, if you want a job that's a lifelong um, employment, uh, the electrical field is definitely the way to go. Um, it can lead you in many different directions, maintenance technician in a factory, residential electrician, commercial electrician, uh, many, many different fields to go into. So uh, I think you'll be making a very good decision. Again, very competent uh, instructors here. And uh, Mr. Pillarelli uh, and Mr. Gentile, of course, are here all the time. So if you want to stop by the school and discuss uh, some additional things, 
and I'm sure they'll be happy to, uh, to see you, Mr. Belletti. Uh, uh, I'm sure if any of the students want to stop by here, you'll be happy to give them a little tour of the school and get some first-hand uh, experience here. Absolutely, I appreciate the, uh, the, the uh, content that you that they gave uh, our audience today. A little bit of, if we could touch base just a moment on, on the maintenance side of things. Like if, you, if a person uh, graduates from the electrical construction maintenance program, that's a diploma program. We also have a degree program, which is what Mr. Pillarello was talking about regarding getting the supervision side. There is electrical construction and planning. But if we can just touch base for just a moment about the electrical construction and maintenance diploma program, if someone wants to go and work in manufacturing, for example, what, what kind of coursework is offered here that can help them get there? Okay, uh, one of the things, you know, because most of the students or people or prospective students that are looking at this video right now are not really sure how the, how the course is instructed at the school. For them to get an understanding, basically I have two major electrical classes, ECP, Electrical Construction Planning, which is an associate's degree program, and ECM, which is a diploma program, which is Electrical Construction and Maintenance. That particular diploma class emphasizes electrical knowledge. You are going to get the code book, you are going to get residential wiring, but additional to that, you're going to get programmable logic controllers, machine controls, motors, how motors work, how they operate in a factory environment, um, machine maintenance, things of that nature, basic electricity and electronics. So that particular course more or less guides them towards uh, an industrial electrician, an electrician that's going to be maybe working in craft foods or, or uh, maybe working in, in an environment that's more of a production field where uh, if you go to the ECP, you still can do that. But what it additionally would give you is more emphasis on um, a true supervisory electrician, blueprint reading, really, uh, site survey, um, AutoCAD, how to actually draw blueprints from scratch in the computer. So that's what you're going to get with the associates. What you're going to get with the diploma is more of a uh, electrician that would be found in the industrial businesses that are going to be technicians to fix things you know, in, in that environment. For example, UPS would need somebody to change out motors on the conveyor belts. An ECM student would be a perfect fit for that company. They would know how to do the motors, know how to program, things of that nature. So if a person wanted to get into uh, maintenance in a, in a factory, ECM might be a good option. If they really want to get into maybe down the road only go on business, ECP gives them the foundations to really get into where I want to own my own business five years down the road and how to pass the code class is really relative to expert. So we'll give you both we we'll give you both options for whichever way you want to go. I think one's a great option. Beautiful. This here is just a snippet. Uh, if you have an interest in construction trades, and specifically if you have an interest in the electrical field, you can do virtually anything that you like here at Corning College because you've got, as Mr. Pawlowski just mentioned, you've got the Diploma Electrical Construction and Maintenance. You also have the Construction Heavy side, which is the that degree uh, program. So whatever side you're interested in, you got to come over here and talk to the, talk to these guys, talk to me, talk to other people in the school, talk to career services. They can tell you about the different types of jobs that you have got available to you. You know, we place people in construction jobs. We place people in in places like Metro and CTA and manufacturing companies like Creators, uh, which is a which is a manufacturing company for electrical assembly. So there's all kinds of career opportunities here. The first thing to do is is you see this webinar, you got to take the next step and come in and, and, and visit, and then you can see for yourself if this is the right fit. Thanks very much, guys. Appreciate your time. Thank you. See you soon. All right. Bye. Bye. -bye.